right, today, today, all right, guys, today, we gonna learn how to how I meal prep before I get on the road. Today, I'm having a chicken salad with uh, with a roll with a little, little bread, tortito. See, the truck stop, man, you wanna stay out of truck stop, man, cause I'm telling you, you will waste a lot of money you got help the stuff in the truck stop in this little area. You got your, uh, you got grapes, you got apples, stuff like that. But is they trying to tax you? You, you paying, you paying too much money for that stuff. You can add up twenty, thirty, thirty dollars quick. I like to shop at Aldi's. I only heard of Aldi before. It's a, it's a smaller store. They got cheap food. You know, they got a lot of healthy options. So I try to eat there and then just bring my food on the road. Today's Sunday, so I'm meal prepping and getting ready for the week because I'm trying to save as much money I can, you know, on the road. So, you know, we work hard, truck drivers, and it's, I don't know why they like to tax us truck drivers on the truck stop, but I'm telling you, you go inside the truck stop, it's a new truck drive, you're going to see how expensive the food is. I mean, you got pilot points, love points, but you're going to get fuel every day, so you're going to get points and stuff like that, but them points run out quick because how much how expensive the food is. So... What I like to do for energy in the morning time, cause you know we drive for a long period of time, and this stuff really helps. Uh, I like to get this Bloom Super Greens. Now this this is expensive. I ain't gonna lie, it was like thirty dollars, but it helped with digestion, energy, all type of stuff. Like I, you know, it give me that energy in the morning time. You know, you gotta do a DOT. You everybody gotta do a DOT, physical. You know, you gotta get recertified. And you don't want your blood pressure to be real high, so you gotta watch what you eat. And there's plenty of times seeing people on the road, the ambulance came to the truck stop because somebody had a heart attack and stuff like that. So you know, being a truck driver, you know it's not as you know being very healthy because people not being active. Anytime you, well, for me, what I did for just working out, you know, if I'm strapping on my low, I walk around the truck, do some push-ups or whatever. And just try to be active because you know you want to be in the game for a long time. You, you gotta take care of your body because you don't wanna, you don't want no health problem. You definitely want, you, wanna, you definitely want a health problem because you know if you go to truck stop, you most gonna see McDonald's, you most gonna see Arby's, you most gonna see Wendy's, and uh, ain't nothing like me your own home cooked food. So I recommend you go to a company that have a refrigerator, a fridge. Some truck company don't have refrigerator in their truck, which is a downfall, you know, because obviously they don't care about their driver. So. That's why that's how I feel, cause I mean, why do you have a, a freaking freezer on the truck and you know we out here throwing straps, throwing chains and you and, it, and you don't have a freaking refrigerator. But yeah, man, I'm gonna I'm gonna tell y'all what I do in the morning time. I got these berries out here, berries, you know, help with energy. It just clean you out, all type of stuff, man. Put it in my blender. And I just get the water. I got a small little blender that you can get. It's out of Walmart. It's super small. I think like $20, $30. And I bring it on the truck with me and I just blend my stuff up. They got an inverter. You can plug your, your stuff in the truck. So you got somewhere to plug in your blender or whatever. I can't find my top nowhere, so I gotta use a plate to blend this up. I need some more water. So I'm gonna grab some more water. But yeah, man, I like I like doing this man in the morning time, man. I'm telling I promise you, you're gonna have so much energy. If you freaking drink this in the morning time, leave walk around your truck, leave by two laugh around your truck, whatever, get you warmed up. Damn, I got stuff all in here with. It's out of my dang Tortito wrap. Oh my god. But yeah, man, I'm just, I'm showing y'all. Make sure you have a top for your blender because you see what just happened to me. So, uh, <laughs> well, yeah, let me get this wrap put up. I missed this wrap up. Let me get another wrap. But yeah, man, it, it's pretty much, man, some stuff I do. Just wrap this uh, little chicken salad my wife made for me. Thank you. She, she, she the camera camera guy today right now but i just do this i really to be honest with y'all man i really like that plant-based stuff man a lot of people gets the plant-based but it just i don't know you just driving so much and some reason 
that food digests way better than that chicken and stuff like that. I mean, I still eat chicken. I don't get me wrong. Uh, but it just digests better. But I'm just making the route, wrap it up. Then I put a little, little salad on the side and I eat that. In the morning time, you've been watching me since the beginning. We do the oats in the morning time with these. And then lunch and dinner, eat this little, little chicken route with spinach. See, that's how I like to prepare, man. I'm telling my blood pressure. When I first came to Maverick, when I first came, I promise you, I was eating like fast food, like a lot. Like, a, I'm talking about like, because I didn't feel like going to the kitchen cook, I was lazy. My blood pressure high. I almost didn't pass it. I almost didn't get, get come to Maverick. I almost sent me home, but the lady had raised my, my arm up to lower my blood pressure. <laughs> I can't even remember what the blood pressure was. It was high. It was high. But when I started doing this stuff, man, walking around the truck, drinking this stuff in the morning time, uh, just stop being more active. Just change your diet up. If you smoke, just try to minimize that. If you drink, minimize it. Just like just work into it. It's just gonna take time. I still look, man. Y'all know I be talking about ribs and stuff like that. You know, I still, you know, I still have my, my meals and stuff that I like to eat. You know, I, I always talk about going to Texas because the truck stop. But you know, I'm just showing y'all how prepared, man. Cause look. You got to pass that DOT if you want to get a job, bro. I'm telling you, if you don't pass, bro, they're going to see you home. But that's why I like to do wrap this up, put the spinach in there. I got some little, you know, green leafy vegetables here with your, your blood pressure, stuff like that. But the main thing, I just want y'all to be healthy, man. That's why I make this video and just try to make everybody be healthy on the road so you can be more efficient, so you can keep your CDL life so you don't get it revoked because, you, you know, because you, you, you're not healthy. But yeah, man, y'all got any questions about marriage transportation or anything I just said about the DLT physical, whatever, you can ask my information on the screen. And let me clean the mess up, man, because my wife gonna be mad at me, man. But yeah, talk to y'all later.